Hello, I'm Bill Hondachewski, and welcome to What About New Jersey History? But today, I'm in Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. Now, where you're standing right now, General Robert E. Lee and General A.P. Hill stood on the morning of July 1st of 1863. As they listened to the sounds of a growing battle in the distance, a few miles east near Gettysburg, there, two Confederate infantry brigades clashed with two Union cavalry brigades, and because the armies were marching toward each other, the fighting intensified as additional troops arrived. Now soon the rest of Hill's Corps hurried forward to join the fray. Now this was not the first time the Confederates had marched past the Cashtown Inn. General J.E.B. Jeb Stewart had led his cavalrymen past this spot on the October of 1862 while on a raid. Now on this day, however, as tavern keeper Jacob McKinley later wrote, the entire rebel force under General Lee came down Chambersburg Pipe. Passing within 20 feet of the bar room with thousands of hungry and thirsty Confederates marching by, it's no wonder that Mickey lost his own count, a wagon, a horse, a steer, 50 chickens, apple trees, and 480 gallons of brandy and whiskey with more than $2,000 in damages. I'm Bill Honachewski and thank you for watching. Remember to preserve and protect our history and natural environment.